Hello, and welcome to the Sinbin.Vegas virtual game show. We've got a heck of a game lined up. Look at our players today. The one, the only, the mascot of the Vegas Golden Knights, Chance, is here. He is right there. Justin Emerson of the Las Vegas Sun. Jason Pothier of us. And then our three <laughs> contestants, KC, Michael, and Craig. Craig, what a hat that is. <laughs> Suck up. The cat that is. So here's the way the game is played. There's three teams of two, Jason and KC, Chance and Michael, Justin and Craig. Uh, the way it's going to work is I'm going to put a series of three questions on the board, and one person on each team will be the trivia answerer. The other one will be the matcher. Trivia answers can put up one, two, or three possible answers. The matcher is trying to guess if their partner will get the question correct or incorrect. They'll put up a red card for incorrect, a black card for correct. Here's how the scoring works. Horribly confusing. Don't really worry too much about it. It'll make more sense as the game goes on. The important things to note on the scoring are two things. Number one, you only score points if you match with your teammates. So you can actually get points by answering the question incorrect, or you can get points by answering the question correct. You just have to match with your teammate. The other thing is to make sure you notice that the only way to lose points is to guess that your teammate is going to get the question correct, and then they do not. So everybody is here. Everybody is ready to go. And we are going to jump right in. I, I just got to say one thing. Casey, I'm sorry for who your partner is. It's, it's going to be a tough one. Oh, oh. oh, that's look just... At, look at that it's, scoreboard. It's go are you getting smack talked by the scoreboard? We asked to get a scoreboard, and this is what we get? Yeah, I don't know what's going on. That's beautiful. What are you talking about? Vince is losing his mind over there. All right, so question number one. Remember, we need the cards from our matchers, Chance, Jason, and Justin first. Then we will get our cards from the trivia answers. What number did James Neal wear? What number did James Neal wear? We got our answers. All right. And our trivia question answers. Put your cards in view here. Got Craig's card. Put it a little higher there, Craig, so I can see it. You got one. And then, KC, put your card one, two, or three in view of what you think is the answer to this question. You've got one. So everybody has one. The correct answer is number 18. Number 18. Peyton Krebs has that number first. Let's see Craig's answer. Is it a heart? Yes. Justin, do you match? Oh, I knew Craig. You do. Was. Three points. KC, do you have a heart? You do. Jason, to match for three? Yes, he does. And now, Michael, do you have a heart? Yes, you do. And Chance, to match it for three? Yes. Chance on the board for three. Everybody right. tied after question number one. Well done, guys. We will go into question number two. What's the implication of Chance getting uh, VGK trivia wrong? Is there, is there anything that bad that could happen to him? Well, let's hope he doesn't get fired. I don't think <laughs> he's, he's not in his contract. Chance guessing if I know. <laughs> he's got it figured out. I'm not worried either. Question number two. Which of these streets is furthest south in Las Vegas? Sahara, Tropicana, Warm Springs, or Windmill? Let's see our matchers putting their cards if they think they're going to be right or wrong. There we go. Now our trivia answer is put your cards in view. One from Craig, two from Michael, one from KC. Let's do it a little backwards here. Let's see our answers first. Craig, Michael, and KC, flip them over. Diamonds, diamonds, and a club in there. Warm Springs, KC. Think that's the farthest south? I, that's what I'm thinking in my head. But Craig, you're pretty sure that windmills further south than Warm Springs? I, I don't live far off a of windmill, so I think I'm all right. Let's go to the answer. The answer is windmill. Atta boy. Windmill is farther south than Sorry, Warm Springs. Casey. Not by much. It's all good. Not by much. So we got two correct answers. Chance for two points if you have a black card. Yes, chance. Two points. Five points for Chance and Michael. <laughs> Three points for Justin to take the lead. I need you to calm down over there, Chance. Yes. Hey, he's rubbing it in. Taking the lead. Oh, he is, he is happy with his game. And <laughs> that is correct, which they did not get it correct. That is minus one. All right. We're good. Over there for Jason and KC. And Jason has officially taken his rightful spot. Oh. In last. In last. <laughs> Zooming out front, Craig. We got it. Hey, I would never know if I was in last place because I can't read that scoreboard. Oh, I'll tell you. You're in last. <laughs> one question number three, the final question of round one. Which of these teams did the Golden Knights play in their first ever preseason game? Not regular season, preseason game. Vancouver, Arizona, L.A., or Dallas? 
Guesser cards in view, please. Guesser cards two there. All right, the correct, wait, we need uh, Casey's card. There he's going for one. Casey confident on this one. Craig confident on this one. Correct answer is the Canucks. Tyler Wong, hat trick. Ah, Tyler what a game. Wong, right? Great story about that. So uh, we were trying to watch the game, and for whatever reason, DirecTV didn't have it on yet. So I actually went to McMullen's and watched on a phone. I called them. I called them and sat on hold for 20 minutes till they turned it on. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, they, they eventually got there, but we, we got there. So let's see. Do we have a spade from KC? No. We do not. Jason? Incorrect. That's a point. Get that's out of the bottom point. there, Alex. That's how you score without You're still in the bottom. Chance, do you Along, think you baby. there's a spade in there? You do. Ooh. And do you have a spade, Michael? You do not. No, you do. No, well, you don't. I can't see. He does yes, not. He does. Disappointing. That's a loss. That's, that's, a, a that's a clock. Oh, Chance, way too much confidence. Way too much confidence. <laughs> Have a look at my face when the question gets asked. <laughs> <laughs> Greg, that's a spade. Yeah. Justin? I knew he had it. He knew he had it. Nine points. Perfect round for Justin and Craig. All Perfect right, round. Craig. And we are going to meet our players. First, we're going to meet our contestants. KC, who's your favorite Golden Knights player? I have a guess. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, I, I would honestly have to say Mark Stone, to be completely honest. But I do have a lot of faith in Leonard, which is why I bought the jersey. I was just going to wow. say, can you stand up after saying Mark Stone? <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Interesting. All right. I had to show my support. <laughs> Michael, do you listen to the Sinbin.Vegas podcast? Uh, not as much as I should. Good answer. Fantastic answer. <laughs> Terrible podcast. He meant to say yes all the time. I was going to ask you what your favorite topic was, but you don't listen, so good job. <laughs> I have listened. I just don't listen all the time. I'm sorry. Yeah, good enough. <laughs> all the time. I'm going to start today. Tonight, right when this is over. Either, so. I'll go on episode one. There you go. He doesn't need to. <laughs> exactly. Right. <laughs> What's the greatest quarterback of all time? The greatest quarterback of all time would be Brad Johnson because he oh. won a Super Bowl. <laughs> Love that answer. <laughs> Love that. Great answer. By the way, we need to remind you that today's game is brought to you by the William Hill Race and Sportsbook. Despite the shutdown in sports, William Hill's still offering wagering options. I recently bet on Nicaraguan soccer last night, and I lost. Wow. Yeah, what about lost. table tennis? I also bet on table tennis. I've also bet on chess. I've lost a little all jealous. Of they have William live Hill sports in Nicaragua. And that's why William Hill is the home of betting. So let's move on to round number two. What we're going to do in round number two is we're going to switch. Okay, here we go. Round number two, question number here one. We're switching it up here. Jason, Chance, and Justin are answering the questions. Casey, Michael, and Craig, you guys are trying to guess. If you bet, place a $10 bet on a single number in roulette, how much money do you win? $200, $350, $500, or 1000 Casey, Michael, and Craig, you're guessing if your partner's going to get it right. That's a red card for wrong and a black card for right. Go ahead and put those in the view once you can there. Casey's got his. Craig has his. Michael has his. And now let's get our trivia answers. Chance going with one. Chance, a big roulette player. Loves him some roulette. Jason, on the other hand, absolutely no clue anything about the roulette. <laughs> nope. Jason, let's see your answers. You've got hearts, clubs, and spades. So the one you didn't use is diamonds. So your thought is you're not winning $1,000 if you put 10 bucks. <laughs> you're very smart. Let's see what Chance said. Chance said hearts, 350 bucks. Big roulette player. We'll see if he's right. Justin? It's been a problem. Also says hearts, also says hearts. The correct answer is indeed hearts. Hearts is the correct answer. As I share the screen there, there we go. Hearts is the correct answer, 350 bucks. It's 35 to one. Chance nails it. However, might want to calm your celebrating there, Chance, because you need a match with Michael. Michael, three points, did you put a black card? Yes, three Ooh. points, there it is. Now you can celebrate. You um, always got to support Chance's gambling habits. One point if you get this one right, one point his, for a black card for KC. Go ahead. His, his name is literally Chance. Yes. We'll take the point. Playing it safe. That does make sense. Got it. 
His name literally is a roulette game. Yeah, yeah like you got to figure that he knows the gambling questions. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Craig. Yes. Ah, Craig there it is. Craig. And Justin and Craig stay perfect through four questions. 12 Ooh. points to six to four. Plenty of game to go. Four innings through a – oh, I don't want to say it. Don't want to jinx it. Oh, he's, he oh went no. Say it. Jinx it. Perfect, Perfect game. game. Shut out whatever <laughs> All right, here we go. Round number two, question number two. Who scored the last goal for the Golden Knights before the season was paused? Jonathan Marcheseau, Mark Stone, Max Pacioretty, or Shea Theodore? Casey, Michael, and Craig. Black or red card for Craig? So, uh, black, black, once again, is yes, right? He's going to get black, it? Yes. 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 All right. There we go. All right, now trivia. I'm trying to read Chance's two, facial expression sentence. One no. from Chance, or sorry, one from Justin, two from Chance. Chance not as confident, but had a feeling, has a feeling. The correct answer, Jay Theodore. is a heck of an overtime game winner. Unbelievable play. Oh, I see. Great story about it on the Las, LasVegasSun.com last week. <laughs> <laughs> and there's no paywall. And there There's is no paywall. Just cool. put let's, a plug right now. Yeah. Let's go back. Let's see. Chance, did you get it right with a diamond? Yes, you knew Chance would get that one right. He was not in the building, but of course, always watching on his television. Do, do, he was there in Hila spirit, Monsters. though, so he was basically there. Yeah, Gila Monsters watch TV. Justin, Jason and Justin, your answers? I got it. Diamond and a diamond. Everybody is right. So to convert some points, we need all black cards in the bottom. Let's see them. Michael, black card, black card, and black card. That's three points for everybody, but Chance gets two. Perfect game continues. It may, I have a feeling it may come to an end here on this next one. It is a tough question here. All right, round number two, question number three. Here we go. Which of these plays cannot be challenged by an NHL head coach? You cannot challenge this. Offside, hand pass, puck and spectator net, or goal before clock expires. Matchers, KC, Michael, and Craig, let's get your guesses in the screen there. Got those. All right, trivia answers. You can put your answers up. Chance going with two again. Jason one, Justin one. Justin and Jason, you both cover this sport. You have to <laughs> get these right. Put the cards over, please. Diamond and diamond. Chance. I realize these cards diamond are not conducive there. to this game. Yes, you do. The correct answer is diamonds that's right goal before clock expires automatic review on that one so now let's see if we're getting points all right casey three points if you match yes oh Craig yeah matches for three and michael matches for two so two points three points and three points all right so now we're going to meet our players again here this is my favorite part of the game we get to meet our celebrities we'll start with Jason, what a celebrity. Jason, what's the best podcast topic we've ever done? Uh, I'm going to ignore that question because I, I can't prepare it with my own uh, material here. Uh, I just want to say how honored it is to play with Chance because he's a huge, you, you know, my kid, four-year-old, is a huge fan of Chance. However, if you're ever invited to his birthday party, uh, stay away. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome so, incredible i'm sorry chance it, it means he loves you though he hugs you it's just a little too much do you not know where my chance bubblehead is <laughs> all right let's go to uh justin justin your wife is also a journalist which one of you is better oh she is by far it's not <laughs> even close like she is actually valuable to the industry and i watch hockey games which is fun and people read it but uh yeah, she's a much better journalist than I am. And finally, Chance, what's the meaning of life? I think his audio cut out, Ken. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think he's eating the camera. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> I got it. I understood what he was saying. All yeah, right, I, feel, so. I feel very enlightened after that answer. For the final round, it's double points. You guys get to decide who is guessing the trivia and who is trying to match. Jason and KC, you guys discuss what you want to do here. How are you feeling, KC? Um, I'm feeling pretty confident in knowing that uh, you know what's best. All right, let's do it. Let's keep it the way it is. All right, let's play. Let's let's play. Let's trust Justin, you're going to have to. Justin, you guess. I'll match you on anything. All right. All right. Michael, you're going to have to make the decision because Chance. <laughs> Chance, why don't you stick with the trivia and I'll uh, I'll just match you. 
All right, so we're staying <laughs> just as it is. For the final round, double points in this round. Remember, double points means double negative if you get them wrong. Can right, we can we get the, an announcement the text, Craig. Of, of the scores? Because, you know, Oh, Alex, yeah, yeah, yeah. So Jason, Casey, and Chance and Michael are both tied at 10. And Justin and Craig still have a perfect game going with 18 points. Wow. We're, we're through the sixth inning. We're through two rounds. Plenty of time for this to change. All right, questions are getting a little tougher. Who's the all-time leader in hits for the Golden Knights? In hits. This is sort of a trick question. Is it? Is it a trick question? That's what I was going for. Potentially so it's a trick smart. question. It's tough, Correct and the answer. pressure of a perfect game makes me feel like I have to only put one card out. So yeah. we'll see how this turns out. Justin, are you confident in your answer? I knew who it was before the season. So I think I – yes, I'm confident. I'm like and 8 out of 10 answer? confident. What's that? What is your answer? I think it's the guy that's been here all three years. I'm going to go with Braden McNabb. Braden McNabb. Jason, your answer? Carrier and McNabb. England and McNabb. No, 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 no. Carrier and McNabb. Oh, sorry. Carrier and McNabb. And Chance. <laughs> Chance going with Reeves. Well, one of you's right because we have oh, a free answer on the board. This is a big answer here. This is a big answer. But of course, matching is important. The answer is Reeves. Chance oh. nails it. Chance nails it. The answer is Reeves. He somehow has passed the other two guys despite not being on the team for half of the first year. Let's start with Michael. Michael for six points. Yes. Oh, massive. Huge. <laughs> you could lose two. Or, oh, yes, they're losing two. Sorry, right. Casey. My Go bad. Better. Oh, no. Lose totally fine. One, Craig, or you can get one. Sorry, Craig. Oh, I'm sorry, Craig. Awesome I was one. going the same way you were. Oh, man. I, 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 I remember Kerry writing that at the beginning of the year that it was McNabb and he must have passed. Yeah, I was swearing McNabb. Chance, do you have, like, the answers written uh, down? You know, under your, 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 okay. All right. Just make it sure. <laughs> he's just letting play. you know he's smarter than you. Ah. <laughs> yes. Well, perfect game ruined in the seventh inning. Not hard. You choked. You choked, Justin. I, I did. I did. I did. <laughs> All right, round number three, question number two. Which of these is in Tivoli Village? Tivoli Village. One of the three of them is in Tivoli Village. The others are not. We need our oh, map. I love this place. I think people say uh, Tivoli Village as well. Just to, I yeah. sure as hell hope they do not. That <laughs> sounds really dumb. Jason, do I you say Tivoli? I say uh, I'm trying to listen to the game scoreboard guy. You keep talking. Casey and Craig, can I get your, uh, there yesterday. <laughs> get your cards in view there for your guesses. K Casey's got his. Craig, your guess is... Wait, I'm, I'm matching, right? You're matching, yeah, yeah. Now let's see Justin and Jason's. Chance going for two. Jason's got one. Justin's got one. The correct answer to the question, which of these is in Tivoli Village? The answer Wait, is wait, wait, no, no. I got the... Oh, that didn't matter. Whoa. Oh, I don't know what just happened there. Oh, I don't know I'm okay with it. I don't know. We'll you'll see you'll say in a minute that it's fine. There was some sleight of hand over there. <laughs> Chance, do you, have a, do you have a spade in there? He does not. The two red cards, no good for Chance on that one. Justin, spade. So I had the heart in my hand and switched it out because I meant to put up the diamond. So as oh, you can tell, right. it, it didn't matter. No. You meant to put up players' locker? Wasn't there a cheese? Where's Tivoli Village? Like, I thought that was. I thought that was. Tivoli Village is across the street from uh, from Suncoast. Yeah, and there used to be a cheesecake oh, factory. I, if I, that's I, still there, I, mean, no. I thought it was the place at Summerlin. I mean, Tivoli Village. Tivoli oh. Village is right by the airport. Across the street from Rampart. <laughs> cheesecake factory is actually in the Rampart area. That's all. Oh, oh, area. that's. Fudgy. Not in Tivoli <laughs> Village. That's, Tivoli. that's shady. There's that's no shady. way. Yeah. And then there's Justin, who guessed the Golden Knights' own place, which isn't even close. I thought it was the summer. <laughs> I thought Tivoli Village was the Summerlin area. I, my that's bad. downtown Summerlin. That's what it is. That's Craig, what it is. <laughs> did you think your partner's going to be an idiot? <laughs> you did! Hey. Yeah! <laughs> that, is that two? <laughs> yeah. Michael, four points if you think your partner's Thank you for not believing in me, Craig. Oh, you ride the Gila monster till he bucks you. 
Yeah. Oh, minus four for the Gila Monster and Michael. That's a tough one. But I say, Justin, we need a bloop and a blast. We got the, the two points for KC. Needed. You know, I was thinking oh. Cheesecake Factory as well. So, I mean, would have been right if it was. Hey, KC, it is I, the right answer. It's just, you know, a fudgy question. Yeah, exactly. And I want right? to, I, I hate to be the guy that reminds the teacher to pass out homework. But how many points were we supposed to lose if we got if we had one up and it was wrong? Two. Two. Okay, because Alex only took one point away from us last time. Well, that's what he does. What? No, he <laughs> screws up. Yeah, he dropped us from eighteen to seventeen, so we should have eighteen. Oh, okay. Wow. I, hey, I love the integrity of the, like the that. integrity of the game is so important to me. <laughs> He, chance Sorry. of signaling goal. It's shame, shame. <laughs> That's what he's doing. I thought he was signaling I, I, goal. I'll take, I'll, take the, I'll take the abuse. I, I'm okay. I got it. <laughs> so the score is officially 18 to 12 to 6. Very symmetrical. Sorry, Casey. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, oh. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. One question left in the regular game, and then the final round. Here we go. Question three, round three. What was the date when the Golden Knights announced the hiring of Pete DeBoer and the firing of Gerard Gallant? December 29th, January 15th, January 29th, or February 1st? Michael's got his guess. We need guesses from Craig. We got that. Casey, I need your guess in the screen there. It is there. And then we need Justin. Justin going with one. Pretty confident over there. Jason with two, Chance with one. Chance has had a heck of a run, heck of a run here. Yeah. Let's see this. Chance, what do you think the answer is? He's got hearts. January 15th. Chance remembers it well. Justin, do you agree? You do agree. Jason, Great do you have peace on the Las Vegas here? Sun coming you tomorrow. <laughs> and all of you are what? indeed correct. They had a feeling. They had a feeling on January 15th that that was the right thing to do. And it wasn't that, hasty. Hasty. Yeah, some would call it hasty. That was a rough morning at work. Michael, six points for a black card. Yes, six points for Michael and Chance. Back I, thought it was, I thought it was a prank. Craig? Yes, six uh, there points it is. for Justin and Craig. And KC? Shouldn't it be 12 points? points? Over there. Four points over there. Let's see if our millennial scoreboard operator can add six and four. <laughs> you millennial or are you Gen yes! Z, Alex? I'm Gen, I'm Gen Z. Ken doesn't well know done. any of this stuff. Well done. All right. So we head to the aptly named actually a major final round. <laughs> actually a major final question. The way this round works is you're going to be able to bid between one and 13 points. You're going to put that up using the cards that are your other cards in your deck there. The difficulty of the question is a seven out of 10. You are trying to get this answer correct. There are no wrong answers again? allowed in this one. Yeah, and this you are bidding points that you have. So Justin and Craig, you can bid up to 13. Chance and Michael, you can bid up to 13. And Jason and Casey, you can bid up to 10. All right, here we go. The the final round. Justin's got my back. Ah. Dog interference, but it's all right. Which of these platforms did Sinbin.Vegas launch last? Last. Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, or Instagram? Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, or Instagram. Chance, Justin, and Jason, you can put up one card. No more than one card. Jason's got his card. I should know that. I feel like Jason's at a major advantage here. Yeah. <laughs> and really not. Chance can Which question was that? Eating his One own you got answers. wrong. All right, we've got our answers, so here's what we're going to do. This is a First terrible all, question. We want to see the bid from KC. KC, your bid is all 10. They can get up to 20 points. Michael, your bid is seven points, so they can get up to 25 points. 25, that would give them the lead. Craig? Your guess, yours is eight. That's right, going, going for the clinch. Go for 32. Justin, what is your answer? Uh, I don't remember what the choices Just were. Show me the diamonds. <laughs> <laughs> you went with diamonds, which is Instagram. Chance went with clubs, which is YouTube. And Justin, or Jason, Jason has clubs. So that officially rules out Jason and KC. 
They cannot win the game. That does not make you the winner, Justin. You are only I, finishing. I think it does. Second. So if it is clubs, Chance oh. and Michael have won the game. If it is anything but clubs, Justin and Craig have won the game. Clubs what, for Chance. What pressure. Anything else? The correct answer is clubs. Oh, Chance and Michael have done it. Wow. Chance and Michael have won the game. You know, I, I'm okay with losing How to a guy like Chance. To, I got all the Golden Knights questions right. What <laughs> game moment? I didn't know where Tivoli Village is or your social Wait, media. How many, points, yeah. Yeah. how many points for Razor, Craig? He bid what? eight. I did eight. eight. So they have 14. Chance has got quite third. the victory dance there. I love it. it. Oh, he is, man. He's really living Unbel- up here. Unbelievable. <laughs> He is really living it up here. Oh, Jason, you didn't Lord come in last. I'm sorry, last buddy. Third place. Last place was Justin and Craig after <laughs> having a perfect game through seven. They came in last. <laughs> they get unlimited access to the Sinbin Las Vegas injury report sponsored by Adam Stupid. Butner. Stupid game. Congrats. <laughs> yeah, that is terrible. Uh, second place, KC, you've got an in-person high five probably in 2021. We'll give you a special <laughs> one. Now. And Michael... You've won the game, which means you get to select from the prize bin. Prize number one is this cantina, Golden Knights Cantina. Cantina. Are they all, are they all the prize giveaways two, from games that you just didn't want? Is a sin bin sticker and magnet. One is holographic. That's the sticker. The magnet is not. Goes in your card. Or number three is the cash option. I'll send you five bucks on Venmo when we hang up. <laughs> first one, you kind of you kind of cut out on me. What was the first? The first one was this cantina. I'll I think go it's with just a sticker. I think it's just the, a canteen. Uh, I'm gonna sticker magnet. He's hey, going I'm gonna I'm gonna interject magnet. something here, Ken. Check sticker your stat sheet until that last round. All right, check your sheet. <laughs> so I you checked and I double checked. You got last. All right, thanks everybody. <laughs> I'm sorry, Craig. Everybody I'm sorry, Craig. Thank you. Congrats. Note that line. Check your stat sheet. <laughs> Unbelievable.